We can make a lot of mask for videos. Okay, so today we're gonna make a marshmallow mask, right? Yeah. Uh, Where does he come out from? Like, is, does he come? Does he come out on Fortnite? Is he a Fortnite character? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so okay, for this, this show you will you need, need a cardboard. Those um thin ones you can find them at the dollar store. They're not really cardboards. So I don't know what these are called, but you need one of these. You'll need scissors, a marker, or a pencil, whatever you need to trace, a glue stick, some mesh, just so we can put them on the eyes yeah. and you're able to see through, and a glue gun. Yeah. Remember, kids, you need your parents to help you with this, okay? You cannot be using hot tools or scissors or none of this. You need an adult's help. Oh, he does it like that? Yeah, I saw my smell when he was on Fortnite. Okay, you will need to first put this in the bag Bobby, and kind of measure it. Bobby, hold, hold, hold the sides. Okay, you want it like up there? Do you want it up there? Okay, now I'm going to see and measure where I'm gonna be cutting it. So he wants it up to here, so I'll be cutting it, let's say right about here, okay? Okay, now, do you see this mark? This is the piece that we're going to use for marshmallow head. So we're gonna grab another one of these just to make the cut really straight. You will use this other part to do the top of the marshmallow mass. So leave this aside. Now you're going to mark how tight you're gonna want it. You don't wanna squish the nose and you wanna make it comfortable. This is where it's going to be glued. Okay, so this is where we're going to glue it. You see the mark? It's going to be there glued. Now this is gonna be the front. Now we have to mark the middle part. Let's mark the middle part, which is this one. Just a little tiny mark that it's able to guide you to where the eyes are gonna go because you want it to look symmetrical and the mouth. In order to get a very precise eye and mouth. I would suggest you going to Google marshmallow mask so you can more or less get an idea of how to draw the eyes. This is one of the eyes, a cutout. So what I'm gonna do is trace this on this side and then flip it over and then trace the same one on this side. This is from a previous mask I've already done. Okay. So this is my uh, middle part. What I'm gonna do is go straight down and open my two, uh, my thumb and my pinky and just, this is where I'm gonna want the mouth to be. So I'm gonna put a dot here and a dot here. And all I'm gonna do is connect a smile where my dots are. Okay, so we have already done the mouth now we're going to place and trace the eyes here. Now we're going to flip. Instead of placing it like this, we're going to flip. Because you, as you can see, there's one smaller than the other one. You have to look alike. Now it's ready to cut. Okay, so now I cut a mesh to cover the mouth on the inside. It has to go on the inside, okay? So now I'm gluing it with the glue gun 
right along the mouth. And just gently press, but remember, you have to do this with an adult. Okay, now I'm gonna do the eyes. And I'm gonna do one whole piece just to make it faster. So I'm gonna cut it here. Now the eyes. Okay, so remember where we did the mark and we checked for it to be the correct size. So now, this is where we're going to glue it. I know it, it, it looks um, like this, but we can cut it off. So there's a mark, and I'm gonna apply glue below this line, all below the line. Now you see the leftover part, you just cut it. Now we're gonna do the top of the head, face down, and then we're gonna trace a circle around it. You wanna go bigger, maybe like a third of an inch bigger than the actual head, because then whatever's left over, you can cut it. Now you're going to place the circle here and place your head over it. Okay, now you see there's some left. It's okay if it looks like that. Now what you wanna do is glue it on the inside, okay? Okay, so remember, you're gonna glue it on the inside. Okay, okay there. It's okay if it comes out, um, the glue comes outside a little bit. That's better because it'll make them stick better. Okay, so remember, there was gonna be some part of the top of the mask left. So all we're gonna do is cut. Now for this part, what you would wanna do is also grab a tape, I forgot to um, put this in the supplies or what you need. You're gonna cut this much and just tape it right here, press. And fold and you have your mask 